Okay, Lou Depot back here with a quick little introduction of radiant heat and how it's tied into the boiler and how it works with the boiler. Now, there's a lot of different ways of doing it. This is a very, very simple system just to give you the idea. Then we'll delve way into the details of all the neat stuff that they have later. But just to show you, basically what happens is this. The boiler is set up and running at 180 degrees. You immediately come out of the top of your boiler. The first thing you install is a mixing valve, and we'll go over that. Right after the mixing valve is going to be your circulator pump. Remember, the water flow is away from the boiler going into the radiant tubing under the floor. So what takes place is the thermostat calls for heat, and it turns on the circulator pump. As soon as the circulator pump goes on, it pulls hot water out of the boiler. Now remember, the, bo the water is 180 degrees. And it sends the water around the floor and then back into the boiler again this way. This is the return going back. Once this mixing valve determines that the water going through is extremely hot, it will shut and now divert the circulator divert the water from the circulator, instead of going back into the boiler and maintaining that 180, it cuts the boiler off. Now the flow is from the boiler, through the pump, through the floor, and back up to the mixing valve again. And now it's circulating that 135, 130 degree water around without the boiler. It just continues doing that, warming up the room, until the water starts losing its temperature. Once the water starts losing its temperature and it gets too cool, this mixing valve senses that, opens up again, and lets the water return into the boiler and takes it from there, from the boiler, through the back. So now it's taking it again, causing the 180 degree water to mix with the 120 degree water, because it's cooled, around the floor, through the boiler, and back out very hot. Once it senses that it's hot enough, it completely cuts the boiler off again and circulates just through the floor and back to the pump, through the floor and back to the pump. As it cools, the whole thing progresses again, lets it go back to the boiler and steals some heat from the boiler. Okay, so it constantly steals from the boiler, but never lets it get to 180, never even lets it get to 140. Okay, so this thing is always shutting it open and taken from the boiler and back around, or eliminating the boiler and just circulating through the floor and back around this way. So by having that mixing valve on there, it keeps the floor from getting too hot. It maintains the temperature, and there's a dial on this mixing valve that lets you put the temperature at 130, 135, 115, 120, whatever you want, and that's what it will maintain the temperature under the floor. This ready, this Radiant heat is under your floor in your in your room, one of your rooms. Okay, so that's how that works. That's how you can take 180 degree boil of water and heat your floor with only 120, 130 degree water because of this mixing valve. And we'll go over that in detail.